I'm Martin Fairhurst and uh, we're in the showroom again in Lymington and I'm going to show you today how to set up a fusy bracket clock. So here's the clock and what I'm going to do is turn it round and you can see it in the back and now I'm going to like remove so. the bell which I do on doing the nut, remove the bell and now with the pendulum you can see there's the slotted area on the pendulum here and this is what we call the suspension on the top. Now, this is a little bit more tricky because you have to basically get the slotted area through there and we have to put the suspension through this top chap, through the gap here and let it rest down. It's a cross bit of metal that just holds in place there. And we basically then have done it. And in theory, by giving that a swing, should be able to get it ticking nice and evenly. Now having put the pendulum on there and given it a flick you can see that it's ticking really nice and evenly uh, and as I've said before in the past you always have to make sure every pendulum clock is ticking evenly. It has to be absolutely even on both sides so it's got to sound like a metronome. It's got to be do, do, do. obviously if it's not ticking evenly um, there are ways of actually uh, sorting that out. Now, if you take it to a clock person like myself or someone, um, sometimes this area down on the back here, the crutch, needs to be bent to actually make it work properly, to make it work evenly, to get the escapement level. Um, another way of doing it yourself, uh, if it's not too bad, is you could put a little bit of card or something under one side or another. That's perhaps if you haven't got a level surface that you're putting it on a desk or something like that that may not be level. Anyway, this clock's working fine because this surface is level and this clock is sort of set up to go. So I'm now going to put the bell on here um, just to finish this off. So we do like so, put the nut on there, um, like so, just turn that round tight and close the door, turn the clock round and there you are. That clock's ready to go and that's how to set up a fusy bracket clock.